All right, so I thought I'd start this YouTube video pretty simple. Uh, we're hoping to get into blacksmithing. We have some items to go ahead and facilitate such a thing. These are those items. So we have our anvil, our forge, a propane tank to start, a knife sharpener, then over here, which I've had since December, some tongs and some basic hammers. So I hope that you'll join me in this journey of go ahead and figure it out. I literally have never done any sort of blacksmithing. I've done metal work, but I guess we'll see how this goes. So, part one, we have our anvil. Anvil's on the ground. That's not gonna work for us, right? So, the goal today is going to use some four by four pressure tree posts that I have out back, cut them to length. Try to find that natural position. Again, I'm not an expert. This is just what I read. Take the tape measure. Just kind of naturally let your arm fall to the side so we can see that my arm is uh, just about waist height, a little bit longer. So, take out our tape measure. Be better if I had somebody, but just let it naturally fall. Bring it over here. You can see here, top of the knuckles. Our measuring. about 31 or so. But the idea is so that when you're forging, you're holding about height for your knuckles. You're holding your tongs. So you would, Mike said I've done this, you're gonna be holding these, right? And so with your extended, you don't wanna be like this so you don't want to be having to hold it down. You want it at a natural resting height. So when you swing your hammer, the hammer has that extra couple inches. So what I didn't mention, when we checked my top of the knuckles to the ground, so we have 31 inches. We need to measure the height of your anvil. This here is a 110 pound anvil, courtesy of my wife for my birthday. So measuring from inside the box to the top of the anvil is approximately seven and a half inches. Seven and a half. So we have to subtract that off of the top of 31, which would be um, 23 and a half, but to stay simple, and because I think my top of the knuckles a little bit so-so, um, we'll say, we'll just cut it at even 24, make things simple, two feet. You guys ever have that one tool that you know you have and you just can't remember where you put it? That's me every day. Perfect, no. It's gonna be perfect, no. 
this actually needs another couple of 4x4s. Alrighty, so I haven't attached it to the bottom yet. I'm gonna leave that for another day because I just don't have the right things to do that. But stay tuned, next episode, I'll go ahead and uh, copy one of the guys I watched, uh, take this and dress it for uh, cleaning this up, cleaning the tops up and I'll also finish mounting it in that. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more.